Do you want to get sick kite surfing harness mount footage like this? In today's episode, I'm going to show you how I set up my harness mount. I'm about to give you just the tip. Just the tip two sticks. <laughs> In today's video, what you need, attaching the mount, aiming your camera and editing your footage. You'll need a spare harness, sail video systems pole, a 360 camera, a phone or a computer to edit your footage and some high performance kiting gear to help you just send it. First, you want to attach the back plate that comes with the sail video system to your harness. I recommend using a spare harness. Heat up the included screwdriver and poke it through the harness. Simply follow the instructions that come with the sail video system. Secure the back plate to your harness by fastening the nuts and bolts and be sure to make them super tight so that there isn't much play in the back plate and it doesn't move around giving you shaky footage. I actually need to tighten mine. Attach your 360 camera to the pole and secure the pole to your harness using the included leash, just for safety sake. I recommend using the Insta360 ONE X2. It's the camera I use and it works super well. What I really love about it is the image quality is great and it's really easy to reframe your footage afterwards. If you're enjoying this episode, then please be sure to subscribe. You can connect your camera to your phone using the apps that are available on the App Store. I really recommend doing this before you go out for a session so that you can make sure that you've set the angle correctly and that you're gonna get really nicely framed footage. Now, all you gotta do is get out there and start recording sick footage. A couple pointers. Try to keep water drops off the lens. Be super careful not to scratch the lenses. They scratch easily as they stick out from the cameras. What I really like about the Insta360 ONE X2 is the super easy reframing. It can be intimidating at first, but all you've got to do is create keyframes on the timeline. A keyframe is basically a thing on the timeline that says, at this time, look in this direction, and at this time, look at this direction. Then you simply export your footage, upload it to your platform of choice, and get ready to fight off all the honeys as they start chasing you down. If you've enjoyed today's episode, then please do your friends and me a favor by sharing it wherever you like to share things. If you want to see more of my tip, then please subscribe to my channel. Meow. You can get the sale video system and the Insta360 camera using the links in the description below. If you've got any questions, I'd be super happy to help you out. Please just drop them in the comments and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Thank you so much for watching. Muchos besos. Adios.